Uh oh, are you ready? I hope you're ready, cause I have some explosive news for you today, people. And since the news is so explosive, there's only one logical way we can start this video. Somebody cue it up for me, cue it up. There you go, now I'm in the mood. Okay, buckle your seats ladies and gentlemen, because Talk MMA is reporting that the Rose Nama Yunus, Joanna Yen Jacek rematch is in the works for UFC 223 on April 7th in Brooklyn, New York. See, I didn't even have to ask you guys to make noise. You guys are already making noise. That's right, make some noise. As a matter of fact, stand on your feet and make some noise. This one gets me so excited. Somebody pull up the Nature Boy Ric Flair face. Pull it up real quick. Y'all know what time it is. Nature Boy Ric Flair. Woo! So with that being said, we're going to forego all the fancy intros today. And we're going to jump right into it and talk about this great, great news. Now we do want to point out again, this has not yet been finalized. It is being targeted. It is being discussed. So as our hearts begin to pitter patter, grab your pacemaker, get your palpitations together. But there are reasons to be hopeful. And one of those reasons to be hopeful is an interview I saw two days ago on MMA Junkie. It was an interview with Rose Nama Yunus. She was speaking very positive about the rematch. She was saying that she feels the rematch is what most fans want to see. She was saying she's down for it. She was saying she's with it that lets me know that this was already being discussed and those of us that have been following this situation know this is a change for rose because just as early as a few months ago rose was not feeling the rematch we did this video right here here's the thumbnail that video is titled rose nama unis says nope to rematch with joanna and jaycheck and thanks to you guys, all the lovely listeners, all the lovely viewers, that video has been viewed almost 90,000 times and has over 700 comments. So for a new channel like this, we greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much. If you haven't seen that video yet, I will place it in the description box so when you finish this one, you can go check that one out. Now, as the days pass, and hopefully sometime soon, we get this fight finalized. We get an official announcement. Of course, there will be plenty of uploads here on Amazing Eric Sports about this rematch. I'm sure there will be plenty of uploads all the way across the YouTube platform. Everybody will be talking about this fight. And even though the fight hadn't been finalized yet, we can still stoke the flames a little bit. We can talk about it. It's okay for us to dream, right? Okay, good. So what I want to do right now is I want to ask you guys a few questions and I want you to jump in that comment section and let me know your thoughts on this. Here are a few of the early burning questions on my brain as it relates to this rematch. Question number one, the first thing that's jumping off in my brain. Will Joanna be as cocky in the build up to the rematch as she was in the first fight? Now, of course, the obvious answer to this is yes, because Joanna's already said she's going to be just as cocky. She said if you thought she was cocky before, she will be more cocky. If you thought she was arrogant before, she will be more arrogant. But sometimes fighters say things, kind of say things in the heat of the moment. I know Joanna's pride had to take a big hit in that first fight. So was she just saying that or will she actually go through and be that cocky again? What do you think? What Joanna do you expect to see in the build up? Do you think she's going to go after Rose the same way mentally that she did in the first match? Or do you think she's going to back off a little bit, play this one a little smarter, be a little more quiet, be a little more coy? Get in the comment section because I can't wait to hear what you think about that. The second question I have for you guys is, do you think Rose should go and train with Team Chef Chinko again? Or do you think she will go and train with Team Chef Chinko again? And again, the obvious answer to this seems to be a resounding yes. Of course she should go train with them again. But sometimes fighters feel, okay, I've learned. Okay, now I know Joanna. Okay, now I know how to prepare for Joanna. Do you feel she is going to go again, go through the process again, go in there and get black eyes from Antonine and Valentina and come back the same role she was in the first fight? Jump in the comment section again. Cannot wait to hear what you guys think on that one too. And the third and final question for tonight's video, and again, there'll be a lot more of these videos coming in the next few days, but just for this video, the third question I want to ask you is simple. Who do you think will win the rematch? I need Team Thug Rose to stand up and tell me. Do you think your girl Rose is going to come through and do the same thing again? I need Team Yen J Check. I need the Joanna Champion fans. Come through and tell me. Do you think it is time for Joanna to come back and avenge that loss? Do you think she took this fight too early? Who do you think? will win what will happen 
Jump into that comment section and let me know what you think. Oh yeah, on your way out the door, if you have not yet subscribed to this channel, please make sure you take time to subscribe to Amazing Eric Sports. We bring you hot topics on combat sports. We're always talking about something. We're trying to make you laugh. We're trying to make you think. So make sure you subscribe to the channel today. Okay, it's your boy Big E, aka Amazing Eric with Amazing Eric Sports. Peace!